E aí, galerinha, aqui quem fala é a Light. Então, eu vim mostrar pra vocês aqui a fase bônus da expedição, tá bom? Então, primeiro a gente vai ter que desequipar a arma dos colegas aqui. Tá. Desequipar a arma deles. Desequipar. Deixa só a arma dele. Vamos tentar aqui. Eu não sei se na prática funciona. Tá vendo esse cristal aqui? É isso que a gente vai tentar destruir. A gente vai esperar chegar os morcegos de laser. Tá. Olha lá eles. Tudo que eles vieram tudo pra cá, né? Aí. Só que agora eu não tô conseguindo entrar. Vamos ver se funciona. Funcionou. Aqui ó, abriu esse aqui. Então é só destruir, ele não entra no buraco. Tá, deixa eu botar aqui. Ah, eu não tenho café. Pera aí, ainda bem que eu não usei esse aqui. Pera aí, ele usa? Ah, ele usa. Vamos pegar aqui. Chegando aqui. Isso aqui tem um monte de gente morta. Carta do coração.
bom pra abrir essa fase é no segundo distrito, tá? Na fase... Na quinta área de teste. Vamos dar uma olhada lá. É só um curio. Tá. Eu só vou fazer mais pontos. Então aqui tem um que eu peguei por ter terminado ali o... Acho que foi o Distrito 2, tá? Ou o Distrito 1 mesmo. Então, vamos reproduzir aqui. A longa aventura chegou ao fim. E nós finalmente salvamos o mundo. Princesa Lily. Não, Queen Lily. Disse que Canterbury foi reborn e realizou um grande festival. She even created a new calendar system using AH to mark the years. After Hero, when Queen Lily announced a festival will be held in our honor and celebrate January 1st, 0 AH, in front of all of her subjects, and my face turned so red, I couldn't look up. The founding festival continued for a whole week. It was so fun. I wish this moment would last forever. But, as the festival came to an end, everyone left to chase their own goals. Only Caden and I remained on the last day. Everyone was still here yesterday. But it's just us two now. They had so much they wanted to do after our adventure came to an end. Louise is off with Kamael to found the world's first drone delivery company. Vidi said she'd found the world's best circus agency. Ringo said he'd write our entire adventure into a song. And Lilith will go unite Demon World to become a true queen. Isn't Demon World in complete mayhem after the demon gods were sealed off? I'm a bit concerned for Lilith's safety. Irina is with her, so she should be fine. If she who stirred up Demon World before is with Lilith. I was concerned for the wrong person. I should pray for the citizens of Demon World instead. We promised to meet on the Founding Festival a decade from now. I'm... Seems that way. We'll meet again after a decade. I heard Luna's going to establish a magic school. She met someone who gets along with her during the festival. Her name was... You mean Alphaba. I've never seen anyone hold up a conversation with Luna for that long. She's highly knowledgeable. And very beautiful as well. <laughs> Are you interested in Alphaba too, Caden? No, I'm just... It's nothing. Anyways, do you have any future plans, Clara? Hmm, I don't know. You said you're going to search for a sword, right, Caden? Yes. According to the gods, a great evil will befall on us centuries from now. Only that sword can take down the evil's alpha. It's centuries from now, so it'll be the next generation's hero's task, but... That doesn't mean I can stay idle. My remaining duty as the hero is to find the missing sword and safely pass it down to the next generation. I'm sure you'll do fine, Caden. No matter how dangerous or frightening it got during our adventure, you were always unshaken and let us... I wouldn't have achieved anything alone. Everyone else gives praise, calling me a hero. But it was only possible because everyone was with me. Clara, if you don't have any other plans, would you like to search for the sword with me? A confident but slightly shaking voice. His stiff posture from attempting to hide anxiety. The glint in his eyes full of purity. That sight of him giving me butterflies in my stomach every now and then. That's the Caden I knew. I... So, 
and this is goodbye. Thank you for asking me to come with yesterday. But I have something I must do as well. It was to save the world from ruin. But we burned the world tree and severed the connection between gods and men. Most people can no longer use holy power. Which means... Everything we did with holy powers are no longer possible. From healing minor wounds to saving lives... Many will suffer. I want to help them. It's not for you to bear that responsibility alone. Everyone else already left, but... I could go with you, Clara. Hayden, you told me what you wish to do for the future generation. If you had to give up your own goal because of me, I'd be heartbroken. <sighs> Clara, could you please accept this before I go? What's this? It's a location emitter that activates via holy power. Send the signal whenever you need me. I'll run to your aid immediately, no matter how far. Use this whenever I need you, Caden? I, I don't mean anything else by it. If you have trouble solving a problem, Clara, or if you need someone to talk to about your troubles, anything's fine. If it's something I can aid you with, call me whenever. That's what I meant. <laughs> Thank you, Caden. I'll take my leave. May Promethea bless your path, Clara. May Promethea grace your journey as well, Hayden. I left Caden behind and started walking to places requiring my aid. It'd be fun if Caden came with, but he has duties as the hero, unlike me. So it'd be best to leave without having any attachments. But perhaps it was the thought of having to wait another decade to see Caden again. Or maybe I wanted to behold the image of him walking away. I turned around without realizing it. I locked eyes with Caden, who stopped in his tracks and looked back like I did. His stiff posture trying to hide anxiety and eyes glinting with purity. That was the Caden I knew. So, I decided to be a bit more honest. A decade from now. Just like we promised with everyone, even if it isn't then. I'll wait for the day we meet again, Caden. Anytime, anywhere. Então, é isso aí, galerinha. Até a próxima.